Greetings everyone, Ajon here. Another Come to Yours 1 replay. Spawn on the bottom left side as the Vermok player, we have run into my skill. Spawn on the top right side as US player, we have uh, net T4. Does that mean T4? Uh, tier 4? Tech 4? Net gain of tier 4? Maybe it's net with two T's and then 4. 4 could be A, so netta. I'm putting way too much effort in this because the early game for this game is always a little bit slow. We got two engineers, got likely going to be two riflemen. You can see the blinking green light. How many pioneers do we see immediately? Uh, looks like just two pioneers. Actually, a bit of a light number of pioneers. We got immediate uh, Volks Grenadier squad. Probably going to see two, perhaps an MG42. MG42, of course. Hmm. This hedge grove here makes it a bit hard to place a T MG42 to cover the central VP. Maybe it's going I, perhaps in this building. <clears throat> There's a lot of opportunities, but also a lot of not opportunities, for lack of a better term, for the MG42. Could be another Volk squad, because I'm just predicting an MG42. We've got a Jeep, however, so there could be a motorcycle. The Jeep will yes, run sir. immediately into a Volk Grandier. They do have a bit of light cover there. They will get some good shots off, dealing want? more damage than receiving. <coughs> and those are some misses there. VP yeah, captured. VP is captured. Close enough times that zero tickets have changed. Was what do you want? The Jeep will spot the captured VP hunting this pioneer. Wonder if he knows. Oh, pioneers here! Put a split there. No hits. We do see some hits now. He's tight at going around tight corners. If it were as a vaulting, a vaulting of that fence would have been a good idea. Standard point being captured. Volks Grenadier building some wire. Pioneer team ready. Tiny way over here. Interesting. Do you need any construction? <clears throat> Jeep is now moving on forward. Pioneers here! Retreating quite help, early. He up. could dance around and there's a lot of opportun to opportunities for engagement with the Jeep going around all these corners, so retreating immediately may not have been the greatest of idea. We got an MG42, but it's not the one inside the building. Where do you want us? It is set up, but Oh, it's MG, set up in the wrong direction. Look, it's facing this way. Where do you want us? What are your orders? Engineers will decapture that fuel point, but does not cut off this uh, munitions point here because this point is captured. MG under fire. MG42 has set on up, has turned around the other direction, has suppressed this rifleman squad, but well, the rifleman squad has recovered. I'm against the this building. Is seizing our territory. Nope, just heavy cover. MG crew! MG42 could be flanked by this engineer, but there is a Volk squad trying to engage this engineer squad. The defense SMGs here could be helpful. The assault engineers are sustaining more damage than they're dealing, so that assault engineer squad needs to fall back. Now the one less model could get wiped. And gets exit on the wrong side of the building, gets wiped. Tell us who to shoot! We try our best! MG42 is going to get hops inside that building. That's a good building for it. There's another rifleman squad over here. But overall, very good map control by the US player. He has a sniff amount of part of the map. And now this flamer coming in for a very, very wide flank. Hitting this rifleman squad does suppress it. Jeep, however, could draw its turn its arc towards the engineer, but did not. He hasn't not reacted. Does actually evacuate the building quite quickly. Pay attention! They are losing territory. He's, this uh, Volksgrenadier squad is getting flamed. But it looks like the uh, Flamer is now hitting that building. And now the engineer is getting hit by the MG42. It does drop a model, two models. It can still go down. Frag grenade thrown. Rifleman squad could go down. Engineer squad could go down. Neither of them goes down. Jeep, far from going down. This Rifleman squad could go down. 
does drop a model, but the other one does escape. So the U.S. player is going to be reinforcing for quite a bit of its manpower. Good time to capture up some points for the Wehrmacht player. But this Jeep is still problematic. What are your orders? Engineer squad engaging the Pioneer squad. But the Pioneer squad is severely wounded. The Pioneer squad could go down. Does retreat back now. And does withdraw. The Jeep could pursue it. Circling around. And there's a good setup and excellent positioning by the Jeep. Central VP is the captured, laying down some wire. Orders. Jawohl, my dear. Construction detail reports were complete. Ooh, this Volk squad is, is wounded. Needs to get a med pack. But you need to be. Ah, Speaking of which, he has upgraded the next battle phase. I'm pretty sure that's you need. It was ready. that battle phase, right? Before they get the med packs. What's yet? Rifleman squad pushing up forward. This Volk Squad is going to be way outnumbered. Ready. This Volk Squad is engaging behind the heavy cover of the hay bales of that building. MG42 reporting. Fresh MG42, so there's going to be two MG42s out in the building. He really needs to get more capping pressure out on the field, I would say. Not MG42, so those are defensive. Though he could put both his MG42s in this general area. Ooh, that Volk Squad. So I'm to cut this wire. Victory point captured. And there's a great spot for a bunker for uh, casualty recovery. Does drop a model there with the engineer squad. MG crew on me! MG42 in heavy cover. He is in great position. There is a rifleman squad right here. MG42. MG a defensive position around here, probably. Construction complete. If it was me, I probably would have okay. pushed forward and captured it up, but I, that would have been a wrong decision. Volks, this Volk squad here. needs to retreat back immediately. He's going to drop one, two, if not three miles from that Jeep if he doesn't retreat back right now. Does retreat back, so it has four models somehow. He still has four models. How did he not drop any models? Well then. Yes, sir. Flamer's on this building. A full MG view ready. of this MG42. Yes, mortar tube here. He sees the MG42 as this mortar tube is a great uh, choice. And this VP is actually still captured by the US player. Hey, oh, Direct hit. Oh, no. Next round, that's a pretty close range mortar barrage. Next round, uh, missed. Medical bunker, casualty recovery bunker, I should say, is up. What now? Oh, MG he's seeing this other MG. We're taking fire! Rifleman squad now pushing his way up forward. Mortar team perhaps is trying to hit this folks now. Where do you want us? Country 42 in a good defensive position, but defense is defensive. Here lies his opponent to. Yeah. Even if the opponent doesn't push forward, it keeps that area well secure. The Volk squad is getting inside this building. Could get some good hits on this engineer squad. Excellent hits. MG42 has been spotted again. Likely to be another mortar barrage onto its location soon. And melee packs it up, knowing that the mortar is going to hit it. Point is still not captured. Two command points here. Let's take a quick look at the U.S. player. Still two command points as well, so... Jeep here. 
No doctrine selection. We got medics here and a motor pool. Oh no, that's a straight up tank po uh, depot. Skipping the motor pool. No anti tank guns for him. He's going straight for tanks. Likely Sherman tanks. Maybe Sherman crocodile, but that's unlikely. Both in half withdrawn right there. Time to kill some crowds. Has repositioned the MG42. God damn it, Crouch! It's a partial burst there, and now it's gonna be forced to withdraw entirely. Mortar almost got a direct hit on that uh MG42 if it was still set up. Throws out a frag, but does cancel it. Eyeing for a frag. And likely he get... No, he didn't get that one model. We got bet one on the Volksgrandeers. Pioneers not coming to support. Rifleman is severely wounded. If I was him, I would try to treat that Rifleman squad earlier rather than later just to get it healed up. Three command points for the US player. And we got an armored car now out on the field. The armored car, of course, excellent anti infantry. Tank depot, nothing in the way. He needs what, 90 fuel for Sherman? What was that, 110? One was meant for Sherman, one was meant for a Sherman crocodile. Frag grenade thrown at excellent spots, getting significant amount of damage. Does drop another model on the retreat. And the medic is going to pick up on the models. Looks like the medical bunker has not picked uh, got any models, so that'd be model number one. Three more, and get a free grenadier. Oh, there's another model there, so he's going to pick up himself two models halfway to a free grenadier. Oh, that casualty did die in his hands. Going over here to drop another model. Let's take a quick look at the. Oh, yeah, there's two models. I think he did some sort of long range teleport. Oh, that engine damage is severe. Did a. There's a big detonation here. Did he hit something there? Was there a demo charge there? I know this mortar can be decent at getting engine snares on the armored car. Yeah, Uma here. But I think it was a, some, some sort of demo charge that may have been there. On the left side, we've got the Jeep engaging the Minesweeper. Here comes a Hellcat. He really wants these uh, vehicles down. I probably would have gone for a Sherman tank myself. Just because it's good against vehicles and infantry. Got a hit on this armored car. And there goes that armored car. Reporting. No anti-tank gun on the field. Another good hit on that armored car. Does roll a miss there. Panzerfaust. There's the Panzerfaust. Rolls a miss right there. He does break down that barbed wire, so now he's this wrecking squad can advance, but it's going to run straight into two Volks run there's. MG under fire! Does get some good suppression down that squad. Engineers captured that fuel point, and uh, Jeep will come in for a point. And this squad is severely wounded, so he does fall back entirely. Very nice. And this is a cutoff point, so you will deny the income from this one fuel point. 
Flame is here. These guys are quite. We got a uh, propaganda war. Is it terror tactics? Terror tactics have been selected, so likely may see a king tiger this game. Yes, oh. camarade. Does found find a U.S. mine and does wait? There's only a rifleman over here. Does he have infantry mines? Does that mean he has a uh, infantry company? Uh, he still has four command points. So it's hard for me to tell. That could have been laid down by an engineer. Observation posts report we are losing a sector. Casualty being recovered. Where is it? Ah, oh, here it is. Rifle squad at contact! The outer cannons engaging the helicopter, right not pushing forward. Supply lines are broken. There is a path we have territory out of supply. That's it. Construction finished. Threat eliminate. Helicopter. Does roll a miss, hits the carcass. Panzerfaust does get a hit. Engineers taking heat. And that engineers is the engineers repairing it, not any sort of global repair. Our cannon making his way forward. Pioneers uh, tag out the Volksgrenier and capture the point. And we've got a master treat here by the US player. And we've got a US sniper here picking away against the Volks. Our forces are taking casualties. And there it goes. And there's also. Did I somehow actually select that? I saw the yellow map randomly pop up. We're losing Ooh, a point out there. Another Panzerfaust. Gonna take another two more probably to take it out. But the auto cannon did get another pen there, so perhaps maybe one more can take it out. Oh! What got it? The, the pack 38. I always forget how far they fire in this game. Under heavy fire. We have cut forward Flamer here line. engaging the MG42, but he's down to one last model. Pioneer needs to fall back as well. Off map, Howl's will shoot has been selected, so it is the infantry available. company. Gets a good fire. hit on the pack 38. We may see uh, M2 relatively soon. Enemy unit down. And Propaganda War came out, forcing back we both those company. units. Enemy troops right fucking there! How much munitions is a propaganda war? A hundred. A hundred for our quick force retreat? I mean, registered artillery in comparison is 125. Can do damage, but easy to dodge. Both pretty much do the same thing. And we are preventing losing infantry ground. being in the area. Sniper! Also rotten! Look, that pack 38 was camouflage. Stug out on the field. We'll find this mortar tube. The Yankees are grabbing our territory. This guy's so close, and they just want to upgrade the Pinto mount just to do something against the infantry. That mortar tube could be decrewed next shot, and does get decrewed. Try and go for a sticky bomb. Gets a good hit there. I'm so surprised how they're still getting uh, three shots and three kills. Yes, sir. We're losing territory. Ooh, Nebel Warfer. We got Kriegsberg, Sturm Armory, Wehrmacht Quarters, and the Camp Graf Center. Nebel Warfer firing in some general direction over here. Cowards attack our forward base. Oh, that explosion seemed a little bit larger than the normal. Americans and that's are capturing a sector. Hitting the turret, does that make you have a weird explosion? Great, hmm. Either way, big miss. I'm so surprised how tight that barrage was. Usually they're very, very inaccurate. If I haven't mentioned before, there is a casualty recovery station right here. Huh, it apparently doesn't have a minimap icon. Looks like two more until a fresh rifleman squad. 
Veterans he gained. One more for a fresh grenadier. And tank of uh, veteran tanks coming out. He's getting out all three of them before he gets his king tiger. Because a vet three king tiger is a well, vet three king tiger. Ah, we're under fire, my god! Perfect. Look, here! Repair station. Looks like he's getting some vehicle repairs. Good idea to get those up and early so he gets easier access to repairs and less micro of the pioneers. Never war for Barrage raining in somewhere. Somewhere around here? Oh, it's way back in the base. Gets it actually hit on the uh, mix station. As well as the barracks, and the damage over time does a lot. Sturm, uh, Sturm 4 does get a hit on the, the barracks, advances. but some time with the engineers can get that repaired up, no problem. One sniper's here. Ooh, good hit by the Stug. Sniper does get hit on, this, on the MG42. Is the other sniper still alive? No, one of the snipers went down in one of the engagements. Sorry, I missed that. M1 AT guns out in the field. A sniper could be eyeing a shot on the Pioneer. Guess not. M1 AT gun. Does not get a shot off. Ooh, what grenade was that? Report. We are losing a sector. Ready to die? Just make it count. Was that a mortar or a grenade? Either way, got a lot of kills. Two medics coming on forward. No free rifleman just yet. Does get the kill on one of the snipers. I ain't lining up for the other one. Nope, he missed. Construction. If that gren if that medic gets back, he will have a free grenadier. Yep. Ooh, sticky bomb. Damage engine. We've got vet two vehicles. There's also a U.S. landmine right here. Fresh grenadiers here. We're losing territory. Oh, I hear off that's how to shoot. Is that over here? Ooh. Or oh, is that an on base howitzer? Is it an on base howitzer? Hitting this uh, medical bunker could be very important. Though if he eliminates more of these trees, he can put an MG, in, MG inside to help cover the central point. Ooh, an LMG 42. You actually don't see that very often in the Grenadiers. The enemy is seizing our territory. Oh, here the Stu is moving forward. Sniper has me some for fuel. It's also a vet one. This Volksgrandir is way out of position. He's trying to get kill that sniper. Lines up a shot. Rolls a miss. Was oh, he trying to use a Panzerfaust on that sniper? Sticky Bomb does connect with the Stug. And that's going to have to get that all the way back home. Then 180 gun could pursue it, but he will have to deal with the auto cannon. Pursuing it is probably a bad idea. Oh, that's a medic model. The medic is coming in for the grab this guy here. Grenadier does go down to the sniper. Now Autocan getting some good work. He's going to hit that medic. No, he's hitting the pioneers. And the medics will uh, escape with these casualties. Got a 
Pioneers trying to repair this engine. Two more casualties going to be recovered, but this bunker's almost down. And there goes the bunker, and those casualties did not get reclaimed, so getting a new bunker out won't be one casualty away, it'd be two, uh, three casualties away. Out of a grateful fatherland and glorious struggle. Honor and Invent blood. three light tank, light and vehicles, but he still needs to get electricity for his tanks before the King Tiger comes out. That shed is receiving quite a bit of auto cannon fire. AT gun does get direct hit on the Puma. Oh, those are repair Americans engineers as well. Could see a frag grenade. Yep, he does throw a frag right where the window is, but goes out to the other window. The auto cannon does get some good hits there. Landmine here could spell death for that rifleman squad. There's two Axis landmines. Ooh, that Rifleman squad does keep on out of there. Nebel Warfare has seen some minor damage. Notice it's recently fired as well. Two snipers are out. They're deadly grenadiers, that's for sure. Let's attack our forward base. An elite heavy panzer has arrived in our reserves. The King Tiger is now Americans available. 500. Sector. Sure, you can only get one, but 500 manpower for a vehicle you don't really want to plan losing anyway is. That's just cheap. A Hetzer costs like, what, a thousand or 800? Was he spend his uh, manpower reinforcing these units? We are ready to push back the Yankees. Volk squad here. And did not get that one model. We are ready. The Yankees Never are our territory. Field repairs complete. The enemy has 300 points. Minor suppression there. Good suppression and it disrupt the formation, that's for sure. Steady. What do you want? Enemy troops are firing on us. Right trying to hit that sniper. Maybe a force fire on the ground, but that's no sticky bomb. Ooh, propaganda war just got called on in. Cowards attack our forward. And the repair bunker does get spotted. Trying to run down that anti tank gun. We do got this engineer repairing up the med uh medical station, the wound recovery station. Sniper does force back on the Volk squads. AT gun has been decrewed. And Hellcat is out on the field. Frag grenade was thrown, but does it evade it? Stug has so plenty of health, even though it sounds like it's panicking. And double tapped right there. Propaganda war activated once again. Is that instant cheese? Oh, no delay. The enemy advances. Fear propaganda company was two was good but man instant uh force retreat and area that's really good Roaming of the engine sir knights cross knights cross holders no king tiger just yet I probably got a King Tiger before the Knight's Cross holders. 
because a King Tech would be effective versus all the infantry. But so is nice cross holders, but they have seen a lot of damage. You see two more snipers hit. They're very low in health. He's trying to be crew that uh, into tank gun. Folk squads and Puma making their way towards in the center. Children, we must move. Propaganda ministry requests approval for an all-out offensive. I'm so surprised still no King Tiger. Oh, there we go. King Tiger's now out on the field. You can see by the diamond, tiny diamond on the map. What is it? Armor card is seen quite a bit of abuse. We could see a pair of fausts. Yes, we do see a pair of fausts. And take on not in position. There's a breach. Get ready. Incoming gunfire. Wolf's grenadiers hold steady. We are losing ground. Panzer Warfare. Minor splash on the snipers. Well, that's a medic right there. King Tiger making his advance. Mortar crew not being singed. Rolls a miss there. Stug and Tiger tank. King Tiger moving them to the losing map. Sector. Has full vision that mortar tube. I would say get it. I thought he can get vet 3 on the Tiger Tank. And I know he has one level of efficiency. Huh, I may have, must have been mistaken. Hellcat does get a hit, but rolls a bounce. There's gonna be a lot of bounce against that tiger tank, that's for sure. Infantry just pouring through the center. Grandier squad is forced back by the snipers. No casualty recovery, so no way just to punish the manpower like that. Ready! contact! Ah, oh, he has a tiger tank. I was looking at the map, trying to find a triangle, but it's a diamond. A tiny little diamond. We can now unleash a firestorm on our enemy. Firestorm's now available. Ooh, that next cross holder is going to call some firestorm right here. He called it in. Onto the barracks, looks like. Ooh! Direct hit on the anti tank gun, decrewing it. Elcat rolls, receives a miss there. Barracks, not anywhere close to death. King Tiger looks like forced fire on the ground. Or, no, hitting the... Oh, he's getting way territory. too close. Getting way, way too close. And Bars just now finally got research for the rifling squad. A little bit too late. Bunker repair has been completed. That is meant for a casualty recovery, I'm guessing. Could be for repair, but I think it's from... It is repair, not casualty recovery. We have lost the units. The Americans are capturing a sector. Now it's never worth going down. Bandit MG42s right here. Pioneer trying to decapture the central VP. This point is decapture as well. Rifleman squad has been forced to retreat. And ooh, could lose this rifleman squad. Could force fire that building, trying to destroy it. The armor card is dead, so we can't use that to control those flanks. Americans are seizing territory from the us. snipers forcing back that MG. 
got MP4s upgrade on this Volksgren gear. Being knocked around everywhere by that assault engineer squad. Stug assault gun is lost in action. Oh, the Stug went down. How did that happen? Looks like the AT gun. Vet two riflemen now here. Attention, the enemy advances. I think that's off map power so sure. I saw a lot of dots here. They are in our base. They're hitting the our base. They're grabbing our territory. I must have just been going crazy. I thought someone saw shadows up here. We have lost the unit. Artillery Bras just raining on in games with good hits on these Volks. When the Knights Cross Holders does go down, Knights Cross They're Holders just need to focus those snipers. Force retreat on the Rifleman squad. Does do a full retreat there. Hellcat does get spotted. One sniper does go down. Very nice. The other one goes down as well. Ooh, both of them going down. And there goes Hellcat to the King Tiger. Hellcat down. Snipers are down. Reinforce some system right. He got a 30 cal, a rifleman, an AT gun, and a Greyhound. This Greyhound could be useful on the flanks. Just make push shut down all this aggression. Sure, you can throw a Faust into it, but that's not going to solve all too much. Attention! The enemy advances! Our opponent has 200 points. The Americans are capturing the sector. That's cross holders has not fully reinforced. Ooh, that Knights cross holder is quite wounded. Now down the one last model. Does get a pair of fouls and two more fouls comes in for the kill. Riflemen are in a full retreat. Is that medical? No, the medical bunker is still there. Those are the repair bunker over here. Was killed off. This was now receiving fire from the artillery piece. Repair engineer has been respawned. This uh, repair bunker could use repairs as well. Mortar trying to hit that bunker as well. And there goes both those repair engineers. We have a V1 ready for targeting. Ooh, V1's now available. It has 150 munitions. Call it down, perhaps in the base sector, to destroy some buildings. It would definitely kill that uh, artillery piece. I appreciate sure the fire storm do it as well, but longer cooldown, even though it's a little bit cheaper. Like an absurdly long cooldown. You either wait for the right moment or use it early to get it on cooldown as soon as possible. Tiger tank direct hit on the AT gun. He is getting some good hits there on the rifleman squad. You don't really see the MP40 upgrade all too often. It's a good upgrade. Cowards attack our forward base. Enemies reloading. Come on, come on. 
how it's raining on in. This building has a lot of health, doesn't have to worry about it going down anytime soon. AT Gun is getting hits, but the Pioneer Squad is in the area, but getting ripped apart by the 30 cal. Unit down. Oh, and the defensive uh, rifleman does get the kills. Oh, B V1, V1. We're losing a sector. Oh, and there goes that artillery piece. I, based on the sound effect, I could have sworn it was happening right in front of me, but no, there goes that artillery piece. And doing a lot of damage to these buildings as well. A follow-up fire, some rocket could have actually destroyed some of these buildings as well. Great flank by the rifleman squad. And the path the gun is revealing himself. King Tiger is a bit wounded. No more repair bunker. He does not have any pioneers either. So he's going to get a pioneer out as well as press for repair bunker. Central VP is decaptured. AT gun still kicking away, but hitting the grenadier, not the King Tiger. Veterancy gained. I bet two infantry are now on the field. They're losing territory. Casualty being recovered. I always am amazed how far the casualty recovery station can actually go. The Americans are capturing a sector. We are taking heat. There we go. And, and the rifle squad is falling back now. Heavy MG! Right, moving up. will left. find the MG42 exposed. It didn't see any models, but it is severely wounded. May need to spend some munitions on the med pack on it. Trying to decapture the central VP. He's actually able to decapture before getting fully pinned. He does decapture it, but unlikely to, to fully capture it. Fresh pioneers will repair this uh, King Tiger. That's Crossholder trying to deal with this rifle squad, but 30 cal is preventing them from getting closer. They are losing territory. We got a Panzer Command now out in the field. What will we see? We do see a half track, perhaps for a uh, uh, Warferman upgrade. I doubt it's going to be the Flame half track upgrade. The Rifleman squad does manage to escape on out there. The Knight's Cross holder is still quite healthy. Going to have to deal with Rifleman behind heavy cover. Attention! Our base is under it's not it firing. Oh, it's the AT gun over here that's firing. First force firing it, trying to get rid of this hedge. We have some munitions for us complete. Targets are ready. MG here. Ready for orders. Warfarmen, unlike the Neville Warfare and the Hotchkiss, this does not make any sort of sound effect when firing. He does go ahead and use a med pack on this MG42. Does get the frag grenade off. And this could wipe out the squad. Does only get two models though. 
The war for men. They have to get three kills. I mean, there is a drop bar here. Riflemen, there are only still one nice crossword. I thought there was two, but it's just it's still just one. Looks like the pack gun has revealed itself. Riflemen squad will either hit the no, the those are repair pioneers, not regular pioneers. I'm trying to go for a stun. Does spot this repair bunker. There is a landmine here. Frag grenade could be thrown on top of this AT gun. The AT gun does get decrewed by the Hellcat. Immediately gets recaptured by the Volks Grenadier. Multiple hits there. Does get a kill there. I heard the workman. Have track, over. Does get some hits there on this uh, AT gun, as well as a minor splash on the uh, MG. What is this, the N1917 machine gun? It's a World War One model. We have 200 points. Reporting territory captured. We are the artillery. Raining in somewhere. Perhaps on the safety gun? Nope, repair bunkers. Ooh, nice cross holder. May need you pack some med medical kits. At that low health, you need it near that full health. The Americans are capturing a sector. Hellcat being very, very problematic. Those is going eye for a pair of Panzerfausts. One. We have a lot of Two. Attention. The oh, enemy advances forward base. Rifling behind the light cover. I assume the rifleman will win this engagement. There is a supporting Look grenadier out. squad, the LMG. The MG's not firing. There it goes. There's a burst. Goes out frag. That's gonna be a deadly frag. That right from the squad could go down. That could be a bar. It looks like from the bolt screen here. We have lost a unit. Lost a unit. Was it a pioneer? Let's attack our forward base. Maybe. Not sure. Standing by. Repairing the bunker Panzer, while we seem hit by mortars and from the AT gun. Morphman is trying to hit. Misses the rifleman a bit. It's not singeing the uh, AT gun either. Well at this displays, but taking too much fire. We have casualty! Objective captured. Ooh. Volk's Grenadier is going to be forced some back. Still force fire on the ground right there. Orphan not lining up a shot. Artillery trying to hit these uh, repair bunkers again. Team Tech is almost full of repair. We are losing territory. Cowards attack our forward base. Give me a target. Vermox sniper has been built, and there's two of them out on the field, which will be good against these AT guns and other support weapons. Warfarman raining a barrage. I think something to the AT gun. Good hit there, and one good shot could decrude. It. I think that was actually a sticky bomb that didn't detonate the engine, uh, destroyed the engine. The that is the right of frag. And there goes a full rifleman squad. Engine's not damaged or anything like that. 
MGT will likely need to fall back relatively soon from the sniper. Pack 38 may go down as well. Both squad is down. The Barrel Choir has almost no munitions left. Jeez. Did you smack both the snipers? I'm curious about that. Maze Warrior with the artillery barrage. One bunker is down. This bunker is still alive. He's hit by a mortar team. This mortar. Hello, cat. Make it the kill. Nope, it does not. Looks, grenadiers here. Cowards attack our forward base. And it's likely going to be a very dead mortar. And the mortar team does go down. I don't know why, but that. Oh, okay, that's just looks like a tree branch, not some sort of kind of mortar tube or something. The M1917 is down. Close squad is down. Ooh, building kits completely collapsed, destroying that entire squad of S MP40 bulks. Fall in. Barrage, perhaps here, perhaps over here, perhaps Veterans here. He gained. Unless it's just a blind barrage to this general area. Base is taking fire. Ooh, that Grenadier squad could still go down. This thing gun is nearly at full health. Frag grenade on the MG42. Both need to fall back. That rifleman squad could go down entirely. It does not. They're losing territory. Frag grenade throw. Does the leader. And this Hulk's Grenadier squad will need to fall back. Hulk squad is down. Ooh. Was that an off map how to shoot? Here comes a war from Embrage. We're losing a sector. Looks like largely missed as well. Ooh, that Hellcat was actually dead. I thought the it was just ro ro turning around, but no, it actually died to Enemy the AT gun. Very complete. nice. Ready for orders. Mortar team does de 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 uh, decapturing, fully capturing the central VP. Fresh machine gun, likely from armored reinforcements. What if Superman first air or was first written? It was Enemy during the Little Big Four World War II, right? Would a German tinker will know about Superman yet? here only have the LMG no pick the bar frag grenade of course will force them back he got to his advance and no gets directed on the gun itself we are losing ground and that machine gun went down very quickly 
could bring up a, he could bring up a Volk squad to claim up himself two MGs. Ah, Both snipers are still alive. Looks like they are spread, and split up. Rifleman trying to go for a snare. Cowards attack our forward base. Rolls a miss there. They're quite stacked up. Oh, that was a good hit. Oh, did a sniper just go down to that? Nope. But very close though. But that rifle squad went entirely down to the King Tiger. The Krieg Spare could go down. A pioneer just going around repairing those structures probably would be a good idea. May take a while, but at least it would not be dead. See AT gun, two howitzers. This AT gun finally stopped firing on the ground. Never warfare, perhaps coming down right here. Ooh. Yeah, the weapon half track doesn't. It's not as good as the Never warfare itself. It doesn't cause suppression. Doesn't cause the fire damage. Base. MG42 will suppress this uh, rifle squad, but does get forced back. The Yankees are grabbing our territory. A bullet hit it once, bounced off me with just a scratch. We are under attack! Ooh, rear armor hit? How? The sniper does get a good hit on the on the uh, AT gun, and the other one does decrew it. Here we go, Knights Cross Holders. Now we can hear the fans. Fresh squad, I should say. Would you got another Hellcat now out in fields with two AT guns now, the and the Hellcat? He's able to engage the King Tiger reasonably well. But the King Tiger, of course, still beats the Hellcat on one on one. There goes that mortar crew. When's the last time that casualty recovery station actually got a casualty? Range is making their advance now. Ooh! King Tiger getting a deadly hit, and snipers picked up the Ranger squad instantly. Ooh, King Tiger severely wounded. Seeing more and more bounces, he should be able to get out no problem. The Hellcat could die this. They're hitting our base. War from in now, raining on in. Perhaps we're right around here. Or not. Folks are going to fall back behind. Needs a lot of uh, repair time for this. Ooh, nice uh, propaganda war. Forcing those units back. Getting hit by the rear armor. No landmine. King Tiger could go down. Rolls a miss there. Panzerfaust from the Knight's Cross holder. Rear armor hit. Trying to go for those snipers. Trying to get a Panzerfaust up from the Volks. Main gun destroyed. King Tiger still alive, but barely. Out of control by gunfire, I think. Here we 
forward base. That artillery barrage is not where the King Tiger is. Sniper's here to support. Trying to get these rifleman squad. He has repaired up quite a bit. Now falling back, going ahead to break the artillery barrage. But that repair bunker is down. Two's uh, sticky bombs. I don't think there's enough to kill it. We have lost a unit. Completely immobilized. Base is under enemy fire. Does lose a rifleman squad right there. This guy does live. May a firebomb or a V1. Doesn't have enough munitions to so. Takes it out with the King Tiger itself. Needs to swing wide. Trying, needs to rotate. Prevent the turret from rotating. He got a vision way too early. Turret's rotating. Trying to track it. Rolls a miss there. Mortar teams hitting the uh, pioneers. Pack 38 here it does get a uh, rear armor hit. Rolls a bounce there. We have lost it. Still alive. Main gun destroyed by machine gun fire again. And there goes the Hellcat to the Pack 38. Grenadier Squad could go down to that grenade. Why is the artillery not running on that King Tiger? Doesn't have enough munitions for the off map power to shoot, but he needs to rain artillery on this King Tiger. Kill off all the engineers. That King Tiger can't do anything if all the engineers are dead. The base is quite wounded, but the Panzer Command is still very healthy. Next cross holder coming on out. The enemy has 50 points left. The King Tiger is got has, so has more health. Force retreat on the rifleman squad. Needs a kill with that AT gun. And there you go, the AT gun's completely destroyed. There's still an AT gun here. Perhaps gonna be a Panzerfaust to force fire and destroy it or use his own unit to kill, uh, capture it. Unit down. Ooh, did that nice cross holder goes down? I was, territory. I was not playing, paying much attention to it, but all of a sudden it just died almost instantly. I'm a transport. Engage in combat. Warframe is still very much alive. It's going point blank barrage on that. Big miss. Big miss. Big miss. Big miss. One minor hit. BP captured. Your players are down to 25 BPs. Does have a triple cap in his favor. Karka still has to absorb a shot there. King Tiger still alive. Victory Artillery trying to rain in on that King Tiger. Points are rapidly being decaptured. He has double cap guns so and snipers come forward for capture at this point. Until death. And there you go. Artillery dead to get a hit on the uh, repair crew of the King Tiger. The King Tiger is no longer immobilized. He hasn't realized it, but he can move that thing out of the way. Sniper should be captured with this PP. Knights cross here. Yeah. 
Reinforcing from the forward half track does grab himself another member. Probably won't get the other member. Oh no, he stopped next to it. They are taking fire. Give me a target. Heavy armor. Let's get a hit there. There's no AT gun buy out, out by this uh, US player, so with our 2020 caster vision, we can tell that he can move the King Tiger to protect this point. In fact, with our casting vision, we know that it's no longer immobilized. The enemy is seizing our territory. Our enemy is only 25 points left. He has captured that point. Now it's counting down, down against the US player. The US player will decapture this point, but there'll still be a capture against them. The enemy advances. They spotted me and Ready. I'm taking fire. Tilly Barrage on the central VP. German steel. This base have seen better days, that's for sure. Yeah, ready. Nice crossorder will capture this central VP. The US player did throw a frag grenade, interrupting the capture. Getting a lot of good kills on this uh, rifleman squad. This point will be decaptured by the US player. Sniper's being chased down. Throws a frag on top of the Grenadier. The Grenadier squad looks like it's going to go down. A unit has died with glory. Medic will run past the next crossword to the low metal. And if, I think he also thinks it's still immobilized, but it's not. It's not immobile. Next crossword has captured that point. Rifle squad forced a retreat by the propaganda board. enemy fire. U.S. plays down to 10 tickets. There you go, now you realize it's now no longer mobilized. Ooh, that was a very tight group uh, unit. Going forward for us, two snipes, but he's trying to go for us, uh, Sticky. Damage engine, was it by? Didn't look like it might have come Sticky Bomb, unless I'm mistaken. There's a Sticky Bomb. It must have been from this, uh, AT gun. Warferman does get one model there. And completely immobilized. Does have some of its rear armor exposed. Sniper's coming for assassination mission, trying to save the eight King Tiger. Does get the decapture. The enemy advances. D crew. MG team's down. Trying to hit that uh, central rifleman. Saw something bounce off of it. Was that an artillery shot bouncing off the back of the King Tiger? Nice cross holder kind of check with capture the central VP. Paul is going to throw a frag on it before it gets engaged. He recaptured. No, that's just a uh, different uh, mortar team. I thought you recaptured the mortar team, not the AT gun. Ooh, if that medic got hit, splashed by his own mortar. Here comes the war for men trying to hit these AT guns. Or completely whiff right there. Heavy Panzer. <clears throat> they are in our base. They're hitting our base. Two they good hits there. And I'm taking fire! Good flinch, forcing them to dance around. Rifleman uh, snipers do fall back entirely. The squad is capturing up the VP. He does not have vision of it. Mortar hitting those pioneers. Base is taking fire. The base has definitely seen better days. It still has command, it's still quite healthy. 
trying to stop any sort of grenade throw, which will stop him from capturing. That Rockman squad completely went down. Now there's a third sniper here, trying to hit these riflemen. The Knight's Cross Hoarder is just... Can't save, could not save for too long. Still immobilized. Ooh, all the snipers overkilled one model. He needs to capture that VP with one of the snipers. Because his opponent doesn't have a whole lot of tickets left. And this is wasting valuable time. That must have been a shock. Get a unit to capture up that VP. That's all that matters. He opponent doesn't have a whole lot of tickets left. He could have won the game if he could send one of the snipers to capture that VP. Here. And now, he's going to have to contest more time in this central VP. Though he does have enough for the V1, which will deny any sort of capture easily. And here comes all the artillery. And now the King Tiger is no longer immobilized, so he can move from the center of the map. That Warframe was a complete whiff as well. Could get hit by a stick grenade. AT gun's gonna be, uh, nope. He has to deal with the nice cross holders. Damage engine. Three pioneers are here. Another damage, uh, sticky grenade. Next cross holder will run away. Oh, I hear a V1. Oh, did take out that uh, howitzer piece. In reserve. These structures dropping. have been repaired from the previous V1. Greyhound and AT gun has been summoned by the uh, reserves. Great your father and glorious struggle, honor and blood. Now he has Vet 3 infantry. Now these next cross horrors are true demons. He stopped the capture to fire off that Panzer Faust. Not a good idea. He needs to capture as soon as, as, as soon as possible. Looks like one of the pioneers went down, perhaps to artillery. Secret grenade is thrown. I'm not sure what the next cross holders are doing. Completely immobilized. For the third time this game. There goes that rifling squad. Workman gained some good hits. Snipers are all dead, fall into a mortar, and there goes the King Tiger. Main gun destroyed on the Greyhound. Just sending any unit to capture that central VP is all he needs. Yeah. He's going to use this uh, half track as forward reinforcements. Knights cross here. Yeah, ready. Attention. Knights cross here. The enemy advances. Cowards attack our forward base. HQ is now destroyed. I think he used the emergency uh, Gavol, you need any construction? Uh, team, emergency reinforcements against some pair of Bionier pioneers. Team, so he does have a pair of pioneers now. As well as an artillery like officer special. and Volks Grenadier. My position under attack you better these. make this one count! And there goes that mortar team. Knights cross holders and the uh, snipers will keep back these infantry units while this point's captured. Once this point's captured, it's going to be game. Oh, 
and looks at this point is being decaptured as well. So now there's a, there's a single capture against the U.S. player. We are Throws losing assault ground. grenades, gets a nice stun. Nice yeah. crossfire goes down, but this point gets decaptured as well, and that's game. This is John saying thank you for watching and signing off.